Fuck yeah. We were determined that Grinder Man was an ongoing idea. As soon as we finished Grinder Man 1, we wanted to do a Grinder Man 2. I feel I'm talking about a lot of the time about serious things and often dark things. And uh, humour kind of keeps the whole thing afloat. The process for Grinder Man to go in and actually record something is that we go in with nothing. We don't have any ideas, we haven't really talked about it, or at least me and Warren might have talked about stuff, but by the time we get in there, any ideas that we have to push the music in any particular direction seem to evaporate once we actually start playing. And we just play music, and the whole thing is a long jam. By day five, we are delirious, we're creating music that we, we, we should never have gone near in the first place, 15-minute flute solos, all sorts of kind of stuff. Then we, then we kind of go back and we listen to this music and uh, with the, the four of us together and we pinpoint bits of music within this great kind of sea of bullshit, basically, that's, that's good or promising. Collate this stuff and try and make songs out of some of these pieces of music. The sound comes from playing live. jamming and kind of freedom within these songs and really wanted to kind of bring that that expansive feeling back into our music Nick Lorne produced the album we've uh, worked with Nick on the last four albums I think something like that and uh, he's learnt how to work with, the, with, with Nick Cave and how to work with the Bad Seats and how to work with Grinder Man. I keep a hanging around your kitchenette Cause I'm gonna get a pot to cook you in I stick my fingers in your biscuit jar and I crush all your gingerbread men. It's not something that comes naturally to a lot of people and requires a lot of patience, a lot of tolerance, um, an enormous amount of energy, and uh, Nick, Nick, and talent, some basic talent, and Nick has these things. Cause I First song on the album is called Mickey Mouse and the Goodbye Man. Oh. To me, lyrically as well as musically, sets the tone for the record. I mean, it, it, it's a kind of hard rock song, and I think it, it, it opens the door and allows people in. There's something about it, it's, it has an immediate kind of charm to it. I see him pounding And he sucked her and he sucked her and he sucked her dry 
and lyrically it sets up a kind of scenario um, that's, that seems to seep into the other songs and, and is part of a kind of ongoing narrative that runs through the record. We took shelter under her body. The video is being done by a woman called Elinka Hopfner who sent me an animated video that she'd done for a Bad Seat song called Moonland. And I called her up and asked her if she'd be interested in doing another one for a Grindr Man song. But what happened really was that she sent a storyboard of what she wanted to do around this particular song. She wanted to, to provide the kind of visual story that went behind these strange and abstracted lyrics that you, you will hear on this particular song. I was Mickey Mouse, he was the big bad We've got one for Heathen Child, which is directed by the brilliant John Hellcoat who I've worked with for many years on various things, um, but he's the director of The Proposition and of the recent masterpiece, The Road. And he is, uh, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> he is behind the camera as we speak. So. The actual cover of the Grinder Man record was done by Polly Borland, who I've worked with for years and years now. And she did um, an extraordinary photograph of a wolf. The wolf came from, I think, John Hillcoat is behind that camera now, being in LA, and this is either right or wrong, John, and seeing uh, one night on the street, on these suburban streets, a wild coyote, coyote that was starved and uh, kind of ranging around the streets. I kind of thought, well, that's that's a really nice image, but let's do that with a, a wolf entering a 70s Grecian style bathroom. Wolf was a is a is a symbol that runs through a lot of the different songs. <laughs> We're playing music that we we really enjoy playing. There's a wonderful sort of self-indulgence I think about Grinder Man that we're really enjoying. Um, we're, we're doing stuff to please ourselves on some level. Um, and, and you know, so there's a real joy in the music because we're playing stuff that we, we love. She comes rising with